This is a nice mid-sagittal view of the head. Uh, when we look at this one, we can see frontal bone, parietal bone, occipital bone. You can also see those corresponding lobes. We have frontal lobe, parietal lobe, occipital lobe. If you look in the middle here, you can see the diencephalon. The thalamus would be right there in the middle. You can see the cerebellum. Uh, we also have the pituitary gland or the hypophysis sitting inside that area called the cella tersica. But one thing I wanted to point out is coming from this brain stem, remember mesencephalon, pons, medulla. One of the things that we have here is, in this model, a nice view of where that spinal cord comes all the way down. And you can start to see it move through these cervical vertebrae here, and then eventually work its way further and further down. This is the spinal cord right here. And obviously you can see the cut bones on either side of it, cervical vertebrae. And then again, we work our way further down to the thoracic vertebrae.